Yo, what's happening, YouTube? How are you guys doing? I'm back with another video. My name is Social Slatters from socialslatters.com. If you're new to my channel, make sure that you subscribe and also hit that notification bell icon. Today, we are looking at things you should not do to avoid getting your account banned. Don't get your account banned. All right, guys, if you are a KDP publisher and if you are a newbie, if you are getting started, you are a beginner, you don't know much, these are the things you shouldn't do because these things will get your account banned. First thing you should do, you shouldn't do is don't open two accounts. Okay, I understand that um, you should not put you, all your eggs in one basket, but with KDP, you can only have one account. Only one account, guys. One account with, with one email address, one banking details don't have the second account don't go for the second account guys you can still make your money and run your business with the one, one account without any any problem i don't know why um people like uh, uh, uh opening the second account that will get your account banned that will get two of your accounts banned you know i've been seeing some messages on the facebook group that my account is banned. How do I get my account back and stuff like that? People are asking questions on how they can get their accounts back. It's not easy to get your account back. It's not easy. Okay. It's not going to be easy. So the only thing you should do is stay away from the second account. Don't open the second account. Number two, the use of codes. Some codes, famous codes, some codes are copyright protected and some are even trademarks so if you are going to take someone's property use it on your land journals or planners or whatever you no know, or low content book it might get your account banned you know most of the time some of you you are asking why is it that your books are getting uh, delayed in terms of uh, getting life going life why is it that your books are not going live? Why is it that you are always told by KDP to remove this kind of text or to remove this kind of a uh, line? It's because that line is copyright protected. So make sure that you don't steal other people's work. Number three, don't copy other people's law content books. You know, I'm saying this because so many of you not so many not you actually but so many of other law content publishers are copying my books you know i have seen that some people are copying my books they use the strategy of going to the author page and copying everything that they find on my uh, page which is something that is bad don't do that don't copy other people's don't do that don't copy other people's work. Don't copy other people's books. Okay. Those people will report your account and you will get banned. So make sure that you don't steal other people's work. Okay. And then what is the last one? The last one is the use of images. Some images, um, they have uh, licenses. Some they don't. Like I said, if you are going to be using Pixabay or Unsplash, always make sure that those images are free they are absolutely free because sometimes you know pixabay and unsplash it's it's like uh it's like uh how can i say this you know anyone anyone can actually upload a, a picture on unsplash or on pixabay anybody now that is something you should be caref careful about because Somebody can upload a picture that is supposed to be uh, that is not supposed to be free and give it out for free. So make sure that you are you are wise when it comes to using free images. Those are the things you should always be careful about, guys. Your account, if you value it, 
you will protect it. And if you protect it, you will continue with KDP without any form of a challenge or problem with KDP. And I know a lot of you have not even taken time to, you know, read the terms and conditions. You just agreed on the terms of con and conditions. But sometimes, if you can find time, go through the terms and conditions uh, because that will even help you, that will even answer some of the questions I see on the Facebook group. So I believe that is it for today. See you guys on the next video.